I'm Devon Taylor on Padre Island, where you may expect to see many things, but not this. It's a tar ball, and experts tell me that it's part of the ocean's natural process. Tar balls have been washing up on several beaches in the coastal bend, raising the eyebrows of many beachgoers. Jace Tunnel with the University of Texas Marine Science Institute says this is common for oceans. Every year we have something that's called upwelling, which is where the winds are pushing kind of offshore and it's pushing real deep water up onto our beach. And with that uh, comes nutrients, uh, other debris that might be on the bottom of the ocean, but also tar. The tar balls are thought to be the result of seepage from under water oil reserves. Over time, natural processes like weathering and wave action break down the oil, leading to the formation of these sticky masses. Um, there's uh, actually natural seeps in the ocean, thousands of them uh, in the Gulf of Mexico, and it could be seeping out. And there's uh, literally up to 50 million gallons uh, a year could be seeping out into the Gulf of Mexico. The upwelling gives beachgoers cooler water temperatures, but Tunnel says that could also play a role in the amount of tar washing up. Yeah, usually we see this occur in the summertime and it's whenever that upwelling happens which is typically in between July September time frame and so you know it's nice to have the cooler water but it also brings some other things up onto the beach. Tunnel tells me it's important to get all the tar off your body to prevent skin problems down the line. In Port Aransas, Devon Taylor, Chris 6 News.